My name is Rastara Sumaitea. I come from Lithuania. I am a young farmer. So we run this uh, 1,500 hectare farm with my father. We are located in Lithuania in the middle southern part of Lithuania on the biggest river Namunas. The river has big impact on our farm because it divides our fields and the river shores are very low in productivity. The soils are not that good, so we have to improvise. That's why we keep cattle for those low productive soils. We have grasslands there and uh, we also grow crop on the better soils. So that's about a farm. Mainly winter wheat and oilseed rape as well as broad beans. And now we're switching to more uh, grass uh, varieties like the purple clover, phacelia, the ray grass and similar for the seeding, for the seeding purposes. We have very different type of soils. We have sandy soils, we have clay, we have dark, moldy clay. Uh, we have everything in between. We started implementing the no-till system a few years ago and we started small with several hundred of hectares. We are looking what works good for us. For example, we learned the hard way that uh, the straw residue and no-till is no good for purple clover because the sloughs come into the straw residue and uh, eat away the, the little seeds of the clover. So we're still learning. We want to go completely no-till, I don't know, in, in five years or so. We breed high quality breeding material that we sell to other uh, farmers in Lithuania. Uh, our cattle is very well known in Kazakhstan, in Estonia. Uh, we get lots of offers uh, to sell our heifers and calves. And the biggest problem that we're facing is the restoring or uh, keeping the grasslands. This is the big problem, especially for the farmers who do not have cattle anymore. We had a huge uh, milk price crisis last year and lots of farmers sold their uh, cattle, the dairy cows, and they still have to keep the grasslands and take care of it. So this is probably the number one issue we face. Every farmer has to restore uh, some to, from some to hundreds of hectares of grassland. This is the place where I belong. And when I'm outside walking on my fields and inspecting the plants and making plans for the future, I just feel like I belong and like I'm at the right place to be. That's a very nice feeling. BASF. We create chemistry.